Alright, this video is going to be short, but what you, you guys are going to spend a lot more time reading and watching this other video. So we have a winner for the uh, competition. Um, somebody else claimed to have done a 138, but never uploaded the video. And someone else ended up uploading both the 139 and then a 137, which would be a 138 anyways. And since this guy never uploaded a video, it's probably just trolling. Um, so the winner is um, Vinyl final vids and I'm gonna I'm gonna have you guys both uh, watch their video which is right here um, so this is gonna be in the uh, link in the description you guys watch that um, it's really good and I'm also gonna have you guys read um, something I wrote on the tip of forums um, so I'm gonna actually move this around can I move this around Yes, I can. Okay. So, I'm going to have you guys read something I wrote on the tip of forms. It's very long. It'll take you a little bit of time to read. And this picture is me as, like, a little kid. <laughs> um, it'll take a long time to read. But I want you guys to go through it um, and just really try to digest it. And this it'll basically tell you um, about microefficiency and how you can use it. Um, to improve um, your sp basically use technology to improve your speed um, at various things you've never thought of uh, doing and yeah it's not that that um, complicated I guess uh, if you just take a little time to learn it I'm sure there's some people out there who already know this um, although maybe not the uh, particular application that I put it to use for um, so what you all read in here is um something I showed like which side to click on uh the dispense rep room haven stuff. There's other uses in that um some places some obstacles will have you walk and if you click right in front of it and then manage to click it right at the right time, it'll um it'll uh save your tech whatever right there and there's tricks at all these courses and stuff. Um most courses have tricks and not just simple things, but it's uh, tended to be that the fastest courses ended up being the simpler ones and people that really went out and learned and figured out stuff. Um, Flash Product Factory has some, uh, Brimhaven has plenty. Also, you should everybody should also know that um, all courses change over time. So, I, I don't know a single course that's really stayed more, the same for more than like a couple of years. They've all changed slightly over time. Tricks come and go. Um, the distances between different obstacles come and go. Um, they change. Um, so n nothing stays exactly the same. How you turn it, how you click it. And yeah. So yeah, just give this a long read. It's pretty long. It's scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. Yeah. So. This is this is something I wrote about. Let's see, what's the date? December uh, 2011. So that's actually when uh, Flash Product Factory just came out. All right. Um, so yeah, both of the these this and this is going to be linked in the video. And yeah, enjoying both.